7th Technician's blog, Stardate Tuesday. Things are finally starting to look up. With the construction of the Seamoth, it finally feels like survival is a real possibility. And not just survival, survival in something approaching comfort. Things that used to take hours now take minutes, and places that used to be totally inaccessible are now within my grasp. With my newfound mobility, I've finally been able to gather what I need to create a habitat builder. And with that, I think I've finally spent my last night in the pod. And nothing, bar a rescue ship crewed by five sets of Swedish triplets with bad taste in men, could make me happier. Seventh Technician's blog, end recording. My God, I love this Seamoth. So much easier. Right, I should have everything I need now to get out of this stinking pod once and for all. Right, okay, let's see. Let's park up here. Yep, yeah, still stinks. Okay. I need tools. And I want a habitat, a computer chip and a battery. Let me see. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Battery. Done. Now, how do I build a computer chip and is it a pain in the arse? Uh, oh, no, I just need copper wire. I have the coral and gold. Forward planning. Woohoo. Let's see, copper wire, that comes under electronics. Computer chip. So now, habitat builder. And while I'm here, let's go ahead and turn some of the salvage into titanium, because I'm sure I'm gonna need it. Now let's see how this bad boy works. Okay, where do I want to build? I don't want to be too far from the pod because I'm still going to need the equipment on it. And I just saw a stalker go around the corner, so probably not right here. Eh. Let's see, we have next to the pod, creep vine adjacent, beautiful views this will do. Now, how the hell does this goddamn thing work? Uh, oh, oh, okay. Um, compartments, cell compartments, tea compartments. I don't have any rooms yet. Uh, I can build all of this stuff, though. Sign and a bench. I guess I'm just making a little tube base for now, then. So I guess I just... Oh! Holy shit, that's impressive! How do I get in? Oh, it's just a sealed tube. Let's see, a hatch. I need glass. To the pod! Yeah, let's take the seam off. Let's waste the batteries. But then again, power cells aren't too difficult to make. Okay. Let's leap out. Hatch. So now I should be able... Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Oh. Well, I guess that makes sense. Let's see if we can't make this a little bigger. If I put a T compartment on the end. I really don't want to build this too much until I have some rooms and whatnot. But I think, let's see, I can make solar power. I need titanium. There's got to be titanium just knocking around here that looks like a piece 
Any more for any more? No, it doesn't... Well, that's going to be enough to make a solar panel. That'll do. That will do. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. And we have a new message. I shall check you when I get back. go on the outside so I shall put you right here let's have two it's gonna look stupid as hell but more power is always better welcome aboard captain why thank you Okay, it's a start. Um, internal modules, because I re... Oh, God, more titanium. I really need to build some form of storage so I don't have to carry this crap around with me all the time. Um, tell you what, let's go on a Seamoth adventure and find a little bit more titanium for the quest for the storage bay. Well, there's lots of wreckage here. You don't scare me anymore. I'm in a sea moth. I will run you the fuck over. There we go. Oh, you scare me now, though. I figure... Build some storage. Dump the crap I don't need. Then we can check that message, which will probably take us somewhere fun and exciting. So let's jump out. No, crap. I'm getting too excited over a storage thingy. Yeah, the sooner I can build a fabricator in the base, the better. I plan to completely, to get everything I have in here, put it in the base, and then I will never have to step foot in this stink hole again. Titanium, thank you. I'm probably going to build rooms and stuff going this way, so... Eh. I can always just rejigger this when I need to. So let's put a locker right here. Ooh. Well, that looks very premium. Now, quartz, copper, lead. Rest of the titanium. Gold, silver. Uh, I don't need to carry these flares. All that signal, all the stalker tooth. I shall keep the rest of it on me. So now let's go see what this message is. Message. Officer Keen in life pod 19. Oh, that sounds good. This is Officer Keen in life pod 19. The captain is gone, I have assumed command. Scan your dry land a kilometre south of the crash site. Stay together and regroup at the rendezvous point. Good luck, this message will now repeat. Dry land? Oh, we need to have a look at that signal. Right, you get out. You go in. Where is he? Let's 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 get to where we can see. One thousand three hundred and four. Oh, that is a ways. And I'm getting hungry and thirsty. So first things first. Let's stock up on some food and water. Another battery for the sea moth because we will need it. And then we can go. Go check out Keen's last location. Get out of the way, you fat bastards. Oh god, it is deep and dark over here. And I've got to remember this sub has a crush depth of 200 meters. 
and I don't like this because I... Okay, I'm heading back towards the surface. Yes, it is night. I have picked the worst possible time. I want to see exactly how deep he is because... I can only go down 200 meters in the Seamoth. What is that? Holy shit, land! With glowing trees? What the actual shit? How did I... I can literally see the life pod from here! Okay, this is worth investigating, but I'm not doing it right now in daylight, so... I think I might be able to cover an extra 100 meters with the air tank I've got. Oh, this is... off sh of shelf. Oh crap, 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 crap! Biodiversity is unusually low. Advise caution. Okay. Sea glide. Sea glide to the rescue. Oh crap, I don't have a battery for it. God damn it. Okay, torch! Not a whole lot deeper than I thought I could get. Let's see, what is in here? What do you have for me? Lightweight, high capacity tank. Are you in here, Commander Keen? No. As always, the damn thing's been torn open. Oh, there is a PDA. Okay, I need. What is all of this shit? Um, an eye stalk? Is that a creature under there? Um, and I got stabbed. Back, back up to here. Come on, put that away. Swim as fast as you possibly can. Oxygen. I know. Come on, don't die. Don't die. Welcome don't die. Oh, Jesus Christ, that was close. I need to stop taking those kinds of risks. Okay, what is that? It's a big old thing of quartz that I can't get to. There we go. Sorry, Seamoth. Okay, and we have another message. But we are all the way at this thing now, and I don't want to... And it looks like the structure's on the top of it. Okay, this first, because if nothing else, I'm guessing I can scan those structures and use them for my undersea base. So let's park up the seam off. Oh... Land! Trees! Strange glowing things. Right, okay, how do I get up to that? I hear some... Oh, what the fuck are you? Okay, I'm not, I'm not even gonna... T Ow! Ow, you prick! Oh, great. I finally find some dry land and it's friggin' covered in weird crab spiders. Can't appear to do anything with that. Okay, I want to get there. Oh. Oh. 
die. Where did you go? Where die, die, die now. Die. Cave crawler. Ugh. Well, you're not in a cave. And you are crawling. Oh, and this place is going to be frigging filled with them. Can I scan any of this? Oh, this is b bad news, isn't it? A living wall. Bulkhead. Why is this taking so long to scan? Okay, there is an inside, but... Stasis rifle? Oh, I would love anything that's got the word rifle in it. Then I will shoot them all with stasis. I see you coming for me, you prick. I just want to scan the room. Okay, there has to be a way into this thing. There has to be. Is this window smashed out? Yes, it is. Okay. Okay. That doesn't look human. Take the desk as well, because why not? Can I get up onto this? No, I can't. Is this food? Chinese, but let's see what this stuff is. Oh. Sorry, I'm too stupid to eat marble melon. Mmm. Nice. Mmm. Also quite nice. Okay, I guess that's where I'm trying to get to, if I can climb up this. Which doesn't appear to be an option. Oh. Maybe it is an option. Okay, beeline in it is not going to work. I'm going to have to find a way to the top of this hill. Oh, exploration. Oh, I can get up here. And I nearly missed this. What is it? Ultra glide fins. I like the sound of that. But I can't appear to scan this room. Right, more investigation. Holy shit, that was a climb. There had better be some useful stuff in here. Let's see. I'm going to take the Chinese potatoes because why the hell not? Swivel chair. It would be nice to have somewhere to sit. And an observatory. I would like one of these on my base. There's another one on the other side of the island as well. And there's no PDAs or anything in here. It's literally just the observatory. Okay, how do I get all of the goddamn way over there? With another long ass walk, I guess. God damn it. Phew. Nearly there. Please have something useful, like, I don't know, the spaceship. Water. Great. Oh. An indoor. Gr that mean. Can I start growing, like. Food and stuff? 
Okay, I have... I think I may be able to grow something from the potatoes. Let's eat that. Oh, just going to have to bin that. Can I pick up a lantern fruit? Right, so I may be able to build one of these grow beds and actually get some non-fish based food. This is the best day of my life. Well, let's have a look at... Wait for the storm to pass. Looks like there was some friction. And the Degassi was lost here before we were. Two days since the attack? Shouldn't have, done, shouldn't have gone so deep. We're not wanted down there. They don't trust us and I can see why. Couldn't see it and they couldn't. And now they're gone and I'm up here alone. I deserve to... What the dick was going on? So it looks like some survivors came up here. They decided to go deep. Which, why ever in a million years would you say let's go under the ocean when you've got a perfectly good like island? Well, there are cave spiders. But they don't want us down there? Who are they? Fish? Eh. Uh, I guess it drove them mad and they decided that the fish had a particular vendetta against them. Okay, well the sun is going down. Um, I have some good blueprints and I really don't want to be on this island on the dark, given in the dark, given some of these noises, and I appear to have a couple of new messages back at the Aurora. So, I believe I parked this. Yes, I did. I parked the Seamoth over this way. Time to head back. Although I really do miss walking. Oh well. Ah, oh, home sweet home. And I particularly like a home that doesn't stink of fish. So let's put some of this stuff away. I just ate the melon. Why did I eat the melon? Oh, great. Well, I'm guessing I can just plant these. Uh, lantern fruit. Let's take you back. And... If I come out of this, maybe if... Do I... I've just eaten that as well. God damn it. Right. No need to cry over accidentally eaten fruit. I'm clearly going insane. Let's see what we need to actually improve this place. Not with a repair tool. I think I'm going insane from lack of sleep and loneliness. Right, titanium for a multi-purpose room. That would give me a lot more space. A spotlight on the outside would be quite nice. Interior, I want a grow bed. I can go back to the island, get some of the fruit that I accidentally just ate and start growing that. And I want to put all of this stuff in here eventually. Especially a nice chair and a desk and a bench. Has it really come to this that I'm looking forward to having a bench to sleep on? Okay, it is still night, but we have the mighty sea moth. So it is time to go on a resource gathering trip. And I am so tired, I can't even be bothered with a montage this time, so... Cut! Base pieces, multi-purpose room. Is that connected? Yes, it is. Oh yeah, this is looking like something now. Oh, space. Space. 
That's dry. Right, I want a window. Let's put a window here. Nice view of the creep vines. And a grow bed. Okay, you can go here. And hopefully, if I switch from that, where did I put those last seeds and fruits? I know you're decomposing, but that shouldn't matter. Oh, now I have potatoes growing. Okay, hopefully you don't smell too much. And do I have enough titanium left? So let's pretty this place up a bit. Let's have a nice chair. And a bench right here. And just because I'm... Oh, I don't have enough for a bench, but... Oh... Ah, I can I can just relax and it doesn't stink. This is the best day ever, and I can also sit here and watch my potatoes grow. Ah. <sighs>